Hey, what's going on guys? Stash again on the review. Uh, if you've been following the channel for a while, as you can see, I'm not in my usual uh, Chevy vehicle. So it's going to not be a Chevy edition review. It's going to be a Forte Kia edition, guys. Uh, yeah, I just turned off the car. I just got on the lights on. So I apologize if you know, you're not seeing fully brightness, brightness right here because I'm not in my uh, uh, usual elements of recording. So when it's like the house or in the, in the truck, uh, I'm currently getting my truck repaired. So I'm in this 2020 Forte Kia. Uh, shout out to our rental place. I've uh, been enjoying the car so far. It's not the ideal car I want to get, but uh, yeah, it's been pretty well for me. But anyhow, it's for today's video, guys. Indeed, we, uh, we're trying out these new Ghost drinks they came out with. Uh, if you haven't, like I said, been following the channel for a while, I've done one of the, the uh, Ghost uh, pre workouts in the powder form, and now they come out in drinks, guys. I actually got another one, but I'll do that in another uh, video review, so stay tuned for that because uh, I got those Warheads and I got another flavor as well. I picked this up in my local H-E-B. Apparently, they have a lot of different flavors, guys. So, I just picked this one up because uh, I have a sour head. And so, I enjoy Warheads. So, I'm wondering how the... Uh, well, I know the Ghost Powder, they actually uh, branded with Warheads in a, pre uh, in a powder pre-workout. Uh, nice to see I found this in a drink form. Because uh, I don't know if y'all noticed, like, Ghost is like... With, they probably with brands, like, uh, I think it was like pound or two pounds of the of the uh, pre-workout. Maybe the pre-workout or the protein, sh uh, protein shakes. They're like, come out 40 bucks. So... Yeah, it was interesting they come up with kind of like uh, they went with like C4, like other companies like C4 and Bang. They just come with like a drink version of their uh, workout stuff. So I found that that was great to, to know. But yeah, they got the, I love the design of these other cans and then they're showing the back. Uh, they really uh, uh, want you to know that it's zero sugar in these cans. So like pretty much all that I saw is all zero sugar. Um, they claim it has a legendary energy, epic focus, zero sugars, no artificial colors, but they do have artificial and natural flavors. Uh, it has a thousand milligrams of cartine, 200 milligrams of natural caffeine, 150 milligrams of alpha, alpha uh, GPC, and 100 milligrams of Nero Factor, and 100% of four daily vitamins, guys. So, but yeah, this is a sa Warhead Sour Watermelon flavor, guys. So, don't have my stash glass, so we're just gonna try it out the can to see how it is. And it's also five calories per can with one gram of carbs. That's so we'll just pop the top. Oh, it looks pretty clear inside the can anyhow, so. But yeah, like I said, I do enjoy the can. It looks like a watermelon, so. It smells, ooh, it smells like a candy watermelon. It smells like a watermelon malt. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll get it out. Try it out, guys. The Ghost Warheads Sour Watermelon flavor, guys. Cheers. Oh yeah, yeah. It's uh, it's what well, it, it tastes like. I thought it's uh, like a Jolly Rancher kind. It's a mix. It's a mix of the Warheads uh, watermelon with a Jolly Rancher. Like it's nail on the head with like the candy aspect and the uh, the energy drink perspective. Which I'm not totally sure. I think the Ghost should get on with the Jolly Rancher brand. They already got the the Warhead, so get for more like the fruity aspects of the sour. So yeah, this is like a cross between, because it's not that sour compared to the regular ones. This is, like I said, I'm getting more of a Jolly Rancher feel than a Warheads. I just get like heavy watermelon taste, but not as sour as like a regular Warhead. But the taste is really good. I mean, 200 milligrams of caffeine, can't beat that. Uh, this is like two bucks. So overall, I'm going to see a high four to five. Definitely eager to try the rest of the flavors, guys. And, uh, let me know down in the comments down below if y'all been uh, y'all seen this y'all area. Which one is y'all's favorite from the Ghost uh, Andrew Drake brand? So, all right, guys, we can get out of here, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed this review. If y'all did, please like, share, subscribe, and cheat. Be sure to check out my social medias down in the description down below, guys. I'm just posting daily on all our social medias and whatnot, keeping uh, keeping y'all informed of what's been going on. A lot of big in the crypto game, so it's been going on with Twitter aspect. Uh, but yeah, guys, we're gonna get out of here. Thank you for watching the video. Until next time, this is DJ. Oh, <clears throat> be sure to hit the notification bell, guys. It's really important to see how you can stay tuned all future videos. So, until next time, guys, this is Stas. I'll say it. Peace.